What's up guys, Monte Recap back at again with another video and like always I want to start off by introducing our Discord. We have a lot of paid bots that we've paid for that you guys can use free of charge as long as you join our Discord. Our Discord is new and upcoming and it's very intuitive. There's a lot of intellectual people in it and there's also a lot of intellectual information that you can pick up for free. Um, we don't necessarily give out specific calls and stuff like that but it, we give out trade ideas and stocks to look at and so these are just a couple of things as time goes on we're going to keep adding channels and we hope to see more and more of you guys in there um, if you guys want to check it out we're going to leave an invite link in our discord and so today I wanted to be going over Twitter there's been some pretty big news for Twitter in the recent days if if you guys didn't know it's pretty pretty massive and so Elon Musk actually was able to secure a full bid of $54.20 per share to buy out uh, t uh, Twitter. I almost said Tesla, uh, and this is massive because this the, he's taking Twitter private, and Twitter is public, and that's how it's traded on the New York Stock Exchange. So everyone who's in Twitter right now is guaranteed fifty four dollars and twenty cents a share, which is still a massive upside from fifty one dollars currently. I think it could go up to fifty four dollars, and it, I think it could even go up um, more because you know it almost sounds weird, but it it's gonna get like delisted in a sense because it's gonna be taken private, but it's gonna be taken off the market. And these shares, I think, are just the the one the few that are left are now like insanely scarce. People just want to play momentum. I mean this is time to run on the rsi and into the charts i mean there's a lot of potential here but so i think one of the the very interesting points is that it tells um elon musk the ceo of tesla was even mentioning that he hopes his worst critics remain on twitter so he's not going to ban michael burry he's not going to ban bill gates you know he's going to leave everybody who was on who was even banned for twitter he's going to bring them back even if he shares different opinions with them right i mean he's he's trying to be a selfish person and so my question is is he going to be a pariah for freedom of speech and how is he going to moderate it you know what's going to shed the line because twitter had problems with censorship and and you know they may be more liberal and he's hopefully trying to be more you know just constitutional just like everyone could speak but you know when does it become hate speech when does it cross the line when is it harassment so hopefully you know content moderation won't be an issue with twitter but you know personally this this stock was kind of dying under its own management and this is a fundamental change and so you know twitter could be another um high you know high-end software company because who knows what elon musk's plans is is for twitter and now twitter's going private it's going to be very hard to invest into twitter because the average shareholder is not going to be able to be you know investing in like we do shares and how we do calls but you know it, there's some very interesting things that could go on with twitter and so with it being private and now owned by elon musk and i think jp morgan was one of the secures as well it'll be very interesting to see what happens um a lot of news articles are mentioning that nothing will happen um, until the deal is closed and so we can see the stock trade and so i think the momentum is there if people are momentum traders that are watching i definitely think that it'd be a good time that if you want to get in on a pre-market dip you know there was some delayed anticipation to this news today on the daily um so you know this stock has i think a little bit of time to, to grow but you know i personally wouldn't be chasing it too much i think that'd be uh, fomo but also another important thing is is though they're not trying to get too political i do think that what, but I mentioned previously about the content moderation and stuff like that. Trump is not coming back. I think Trump is too inflammatory. And also, no matter what you want to label it, Capital Six in, Insurrection, Riot, whatever, you know, whoever you want to blame or whatever like that, it, you cannot deny that Trump didn't add fuel to the flame. Whether he started it, whether he commanded the entire thing is up for debate, but you cannot say that he didn't use Twitter and his social media platforms to, to funnel that. But that is not what this video is about. It's just, that's another point. Elon Musk will not be letting Trump come onto the site. And so they want, they think that it mentions hashtag truth social. This is why truth social, I don't think is going anywhere. It has a backdoor end bug. So you can make like 10,000 accounts if you want of famous people if you want. But I mean, this stock has been on a steady decrease and we might do a video on this soon. This stock is down 66% and I think it's going to go lower. The fundamentals are just not there. And there's a rumor that they won't uh, clear for the merger and that it won't merge with um, Trump's TMT, which is technology, media, and telecommunications uh no tele i think it's it's tech media tech media and telecommunications yep i'm right my bad my apologies but back to twitter i think personally that the momentum is there if you can play spreads i think would be the best thing i would sell put put i would say put debit spreads no put credit spreads that's what i would sell 
and that's how I think he could squeeze out some premium and you know be pretty protected because there is a lot of retail momentum that will be aping in now a lot of the Tesla bros are now aping into Twitter um, I know some momentum traders are talking about Twitter so keep it on the horizon this is gonna be a new video format with you guys we're gonna keep it a little shorter so this has been monetary recap guys I uh, hope you like comment subscribe make sure you leave us some constructive criticism in the comments let us know we'll be doing an update video on AMD very soon hope you guys enjoy it have a nice night make a lot of money boys